What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Alex Costa and you guys have been requesting a video for so long about what I eat in a day. Well, guess what? Today's the day I'm gonna tell you guys everything that I eat every single day. I have a pretty set like meal plan routine of what I eat. I worked with a nutritionist recently to figure out exactly what I needed in my body to get the results that I've been expecting that I want. All right, right now I'm in Coachella prep mode. So I'm in low carb mode. Let me show you guys how I start my day. I usually wake up pretty early. You guys know that you've seen um, some of my videos about how I wake up pretty early to get the day started. And then I start cooking. So usually this is what I do. The first thing I do in the morning, all right, is make my protein shake. Now, I love this protein shake. I have a sweet tooth, so for me, anything with fruit, like I really enjoy that. That's kind of like my, my cheat uh, thing for the day. So this is what I usually have in my smoothie. Um, I buy frozen strawberries, okay, and I usually do, they're pretty large, so I'll do usually like three of them. That's it. And then I'll grab some frozen blueberries. Now I'm pretty generous with the amount in here. Boom. After that, this is a protein that I've been um, um, having for a while now. It's the Vega Sport Premium Protein. It's a little bit more on the pricey side because of the ingredients in here, because it's vegan. But this is what my nutritionist recommended and who am I to go against him? He is a beast, he's a, way larger than me. He will beat me up. So, one scoop of that heaping scoop, so pretty, pretty large scoop there. The one thing about this protein, if you guys are gonna get it, I'll give you this advice now, is it's pretty powdery, so you need way more water than whey protein for it to actually mix really well. So I fill it up pretty much to the top with water to really get it going there. There you go. One tip that I'm gonna give you guys who need energy in the morning, who drink coffee is, this is what I do, not all the time, but maybe like two or three times a week when I wake up and I'm feeling tired. I actually have an espresso machine at home. So what I'll do is I'll make one of these coffees in the lowest heat setting and in the smallest size here. And I'll literally just go like this and get some coffee in there. So it gives me that energy boost in the morning that I really need and it gives me all the nutrients that I want to wake up feeling super fresh and ready to take on my day. Clean up, very important. So you can see that even with all that water that I put in, it's really thick. All right, so this is, this is almost a meal on its own. It's really filling, but also really healthy. And it has all that protein. It has a little bit of that sugar from the fruit, which is natural sugar, good for you. Here we go, cheers. Mm. Ah, so good. These are the vitamins that I take every day. So what I do is I divide them into every day of the week, put everything in here. I kind of messed up this week, but it's all good. So mostly I do multivitamins. These are the ones that I take. These are just the ones that work for me. Everybody's needs and body is different, right? So see what works for you. But I like this one here a lot. You take three of these a day. Um, this is for my skin. I take this right here that my nutritionist recommended. Some fish oil. That's it. So I take these, these four right here. So for breakfast, usually what I do is while I'm sipping on the smoothie, usually this is what happens. If I have to wake up super early in the morning and go work out, if I have a class or something like that, I just have the smoothie, go work out, come home and eat my breakfast. If I have a slower morning, I don't have to wake up or do something right away, then I'll usually make the smoothie as I'm making the eggs and have both at the same time. So here we go, let's grab some eggs. Boom, three eggs. I used to be super like, oh, I'm gonna make a nice looking omelet and it's gonna look cool. And then I'll, you know, put it in a bowl and put some almond milk. Now I'm just like, nah, I just, efficiency at all times. I just break the eggs in there. Turkey breast, usually just kind of slice it with my hands like this. Just throw it right in. Like I said, not the most appealing breakfast, honestly, but I don't care as long as I'm getting everything that I need into my body, that's perfect for me. This is looking good, getting there. It's 
almost like an omelet. Didn't even try it. So you guys saw how quick and easy that was. I don't like to take time cooking. I don't like to cook, as you guys already know if you watch my videos, but I do like to be quick, efficient, and I do like it to taste good, or decent at least, right? As long as I'm getting everything that I need into my body, I'm happy. Didn't use any salt, just because the turkey breast uh, slices already have a little bit of pepper in it, so it does have a little, like, it, it tastes really good. So, easy, not even five minutes. I'm getting everything that I need from here and here, and I'm ready to take on my day. All right, fasting forward here to the afternoon. And uh, this is what I have for lunch. I usually start with a shot of tequila. Um, no, I'm just kidding, I really don't. I really don't. Not, that's not how it goes. <laughs> but as we talked about before, I do like to be efficient. I don't like to cook. I like to have everything ready because I'm busy and sometimes I get really hungry um, and I don't have time to cook in the afternoon. So I get my meals delivered. And this is what I, this is my fridge, by the way. This is what I usually have for my lunch. Let me open this up. So we have, this is um, chicken, chicken meatballs with asparagus with wild rice. So low carbs, tastes really good. I don't know if you guys have meal uh, deliveries where you live. I live in LA and there's a lot of options here. So this is amazing. It tastes really good and it, I get everything that I need. Again, this was also designed for me by a nutritionist. So I know that I'm getting everything that I need for my lunch right in here. And guys, of course I get these meals delivered to make it easy, but you don't have to do this. You can cook it yourself. You can cook everything on Sunday and then just put it in your fridge. Just go to the supermarket, the grocery store, get some chicken, cook it yourself, and it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna save you some time, so there you go. Guys, one of the things that I talk about a lot on the channel is making sure that you guys are hydrated, right? So drinking lots of water. When I'm having lunch, I usually just have water. That's, it's kind of boring sometimes, but I don't mind, I'm used to it. Again, I have that mentality of food is fuel. I'm getting everything that I need. Um, so yeah, this is usually what I will have my lunch with. Lots and lots of water. And I drink a ton of water. Not only, you know, because of the smoothies and all that, but also just because I love it. I just love the feeling. It makes my skin feel and look better. It makes like your nails, your hair, everything just looks and feels a lot better. Between lunch and dinner, I definitely get pretty hungry. So I have a snack now. Usually it's an apple or I'm gonna have a protein bar. Um, I have a protein bar sometimes twice a day. Again, mostly because I have a sweet tooth and I really like how this, uh, this protein bar here tastes. This is the Power Crunch protein bar. Um, these are the ones that I like right here. And then this one is the Vega protein bar as well. So it's a vegan protein bar, which is really good. So you have a couple of options here that you can pick from. Um, I like to change it up a bit, but honestly, this is my all time favorite. Like I buy boxes of these. I buy like five boxes for the whole month and I love them, so good. It's kind of like my, my cheat thing along with the smoothie. Dinner is served. All right, just like that. You know why? Because I got it delivered and I didn't cook it. That's why it looks so good because if I cook this, my first of all, my apartment would be a mess and then second of all, it would not taste nearly as good as this tastes. Um, so this is usually what I have for dinner. So very similar to my lunch. Um, the vegetable it was changed, so instead of asparagus, I have broccoli. I'm still eating the wild rice, um, and I'm having chicken as well. This time, just the chicken breast, not the chicken meatballs. So, really good meal. Uh, it fills me up. It makes me feel really good. Um, and then at night, before I go to bed, I have another protein shake. Now, it's the same exact thing. Um, I don't have it right before I go to bed because I don't like that feeling of like being, being really full when I lay down. So I have this usually right after dinner, you know, like 8 p.m., 9 p.m., um, when I'm like hungry between dinner and, and bedtime. And then I go to bed around 10 o'clock. So I go to bed pretty early. That's it. That's pretty much what I eat in a day. If you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Alex Costa and subscribe. Subscribe if you liked this video because that means that I should be posting more and more nutrition videos, fitness videos, fashion videos, grooming hair videos, hair videos, and so much more. 
trying to bring as much as I can here for you guys in the channel. So thank you guys so much for your support uh, and I'll see you again soon. Peace.